it doesn't seem fair that some people can't get married. Uh, yeah, yeah. I can just put them up whenever I want. Uh, hey, which one makes the... And then I met them in the air conditioner. All right. I've been watching a lot of videos on the Keltec PMR30. I just bought one the other day. I had a couple of little problems when I first got it. It wouldn't run. And Keltec says things about the ammunition. I've watched some videos. It seems like uh, some people's guns will run on some ammunition that it's not called that it doesn't call for, and some people's guns will run on any ammunition and some people's guns mess up on all ammunition at least one time for every magazine well i had that problem for like a day and then i figured out what to do and i fixed it and i'm about to show y'all what to do first thing you do take your pen out Okay, push your slide off. All right, this is a brand new gun. I've only had a week, less than a week. And it was dry when I got it. There was no oil or any kind of lube or anything in this gun. And when you would slide to slide back and forth, you could feel it kind of was, uh, it felt like the plastic was binding up against itself. And my dad being the kind of guy that he is, he loves this stuff right here. It's all he wants to use on guns. And honestly, it's been pretty good for the last 30 years on his guns. So I decided to put some of it in my gun. I put some of it on my slides. Anything that slides back and forth, I'll put three and one all on it. The barrel. And anything that slides, take it back off and show you again. Any part that slides on another part, I dabbed a little bit of three and one oil on. And actually there's a little bit too much in there right now, but it doesn't seem to harm anything. And really you need to be cleaning your gun pretty often anyway. So all I do is just take it out to my air compressor in my building and blow it out every time I shoot it. And then I'll clean it really good every now and again. But you gotta blow it out about every time you shoot it and get all the gunk out of it so it don't get built up to begin with. But I also worked on my magazine. This is how you get the magazine apart. Put this in there, push. Comes apart. Take your spring out. This piece right here, I put three in one oil on the slides, the part that uh, interferes with the size of the magazine. I put it back up in there, put my spring back in, put my interference piece back in. I don't know what it's called, I don't care. Now you, your magazine's fixed. Your magazine will load easier slide the new shells up into the mag into the uh, chamber easier push them up when it needs to push them up between shots and i'm being 100 percent honest i have not had one hang up since i old this gun with three and one oil somebody might tell me i'm crazy and the three and one oil will eat the polymer up and destroy it i don't know all i know is what i get out of the results and so far the results have been fantastic. This thing is so smooth. It's not hang up one time since I did it. Try it. Let me know what you think.